Click subscribe to get latest news and don't forget to press the bell icon. Was the Russian lawyer meeting with Donald Trump, Jr. set up? The lawyer, Moscow attorney Natalia Vazelnitskaya, was connected to Fusion GPS, the company hired by Democrats to do opposition research on Donald Trump for a Hillary Clinton ally. Fusion GPS was behind the dirty dossier on Trump that Democrats and media then spread. Here's Vazelnitskaya sitting right behind the Obama administration's ambassador to Russia, Michael McFaul amongst other Obama officials, about a week after the meeting with Trump. Jr. The question was how was Natalia Vazelnitskaya in the country when she had been turned down for a visa to enter? The answer? Loretta Lynch determined there were exceptional circumstances to let her in. From the Hill, the Moscow lawyer had been turned down for a visa to enter the U.S. lawfully but then was granted special immigration parole by then-Attorney General Loretta Lynch for the limited purpose of helping a company owned by Russian businessman Denis Katsev, her client defend itself against a Justice Department asset forfeiture case in federal court in New York City. But her actions were for far more than that case, as the facts show she was involved in lobbying actions against the Magnitsky Act while she was here. Moreover, she appears to have stayed beyond the permitted time even by the exception given. The U.S. Attorney's Office in New York confirmed Wednesday to the Hill that it let Vazelnitskaya into the country on a grant of immigration parole from October 2015 to early January 2016. Why she was still here in June 2016 to meet Trump, Jr. then? It's not at all clear that she is Kremlin-connected, as initial MSM media reports claimed. But if she is, why did Loretta Lynch make an exception to let her in? It seems to cry set up. Curiouser and curiouser.